Family activities like going to the movies, going to the park, or even out on the water are sometimes taken for granted. But for foster kids, these activities uh, uh, may be um, very important. KFDM's Kara Dixon checked out how one local club is showing these kids their hobby. Jim Richardson's been sailing for three years. Everybody likes to go fast, so, you know, getting out of the water, going fast, and the wind in our hair, but <laughs> so to speak. Richardson worked with the Department of Family Protective Services. Now a board member of the Port Arthur Yacht Club on Pleasure Island, Richardson decided to merge his two interests giving foster kids a new experience. We get to provide an opportunity for them that they may not normally get. At the end of July, there were more than 16,000 foster kids aged 17 and under in the state. 250 live in Jefferson County. Sherry Pulliam of Child Protective Services says many of the children are waiting to be adopted. We get them out, we teach them, you know, show them everything on the boat, sails, how to point. Alyssa Martin works with the children. She says it brings back memories. It brings back your youth. It gives you um, different insight on each girl. It gives you um, more understanding of what they're going through. Activities like sailing give the girls a sense of belonging. They enjoy being wanted. They do. They enjoy going to different places and learning new things. And I think it'll help them more as an aspect of being accepted. And being accepted is exactly what the Port Arthur Yacht Club wants them to feel. When we get to do that, it just fills our hearts. The main sheet? The main sheet. Oh, okay. Got it. In Pleasure Island, Kara Dixon, KFDM 6 News. To learn more about foster children or the Port Arthur Yacht Club, visit our website at kfdm.com.